One of the most important skills I've learned in my cellular and molecular biology lab is micropipetting. Choosing the right pipette and tips matters for accuracy. Each pipette is made for a specific volume range, from as little as half a microliter to as much as a thousand. Learning how to adjust the dial and set the correct volume was one of the first steps. At first, even holding the pipette correctly took practice. I learned the importance of keeping it upright, pressing to the first stop to draw, and the second stop to dispense. Small motions make a big difference in accuracy. Once I understood the technique, I applied it in our yeast experiments, preparing cuvettes for optical density readings and ensuring samples were well mixed before measurement. By the end of the semester, I was creating dilution plates and performing spot assays with confidence. Mastering micropipetting taught me patience, precision, and how small details can define good research. Every experiment starts with a single drop, and now I can handle each one with confidence.